Welcome to the Sports Card Talk Show. To the Sports Card Talk the Show. Sports Card Talk Show with Kevin Anderson and Lauren Walker, the, the Skull Brothers. Hey, hey, everybody. Skull Bro Lauren coming at you with another 10 on Tuesday, number 20 today. This is a short print edition. I managed to snag a few short prints and uh, I'm going to show them off here. Uh, they are uh, a new member of the Minnesota Vikings, Xavier Woods. We signed him this year in free agency. This is a 2019 Select uh, Concourse. This is a pink variation of the card. And it's numbered out of 10. Number 10 out of 10. Uh, that one I paid uh, six dollars and forty-five cents with three dollars and ninety-nine cents shipping. I'd actually never even seen uh, the pink one from that year. I don't think I've seen you know any Viking in the pink, so I was pretty excited to to grab onto that one. The next one now these I picked up as a lot or not a lot, but from the same seller. So I saved on the shipping on these ones. This is a uh, the gold out of 10. Number five out of 10. I paid six and a half dollars. Uh, and the shipping on this was uh, $4.75 is what, what his uh, on a single card was. And then he added 50 cents shipping for every additional card purchased and he had a few of these up so I also won this uh, orange pulsar first off the line prism they're numbered out of 11 so numbered seven out of 11 7 11 it's kind of cool I have not been in a 7 eleven for a long time Are those things even up there anymore we don't have them where I live, I don't think. Um, yeah, paid five and a half dollars shipping. I won the gold one first for six and a half. I don't know if the the guy I was bidding against on that card uh, um, wanted the gold one more or not, or after the gold one got uh, won, he decided to just back off the other auctions. But I was assuming that sometimes in order you win the first card at an auction, the prices go up because you know the other guy's like oh you know um i've got competition i just lost so he'll amp up his bidding or they'll you know uh back out on the rest because they're also looking to save on that combined shipping you know so yeah i won that one for five and a half i was pretty happy about that and the last card i bought one from that seller was the green prism and that one is numbered five out of five. And I got this one for five and a half dollars too. That's kind of where I feel like maybe the guy that uh, I beat out on the gold did back off because, you know, you just don't see out of five cards too often. And uh, yeah, five and a half dollars. So it cost me five dollars and 75 cents shipping for the three of them combined. The whole order was, um, uh, I'll put a picture up, but it was like $25, I think, uh, total with taxes and stuff. So I've got, I got all four of these cards for just a shade um, under, under $40. And, you know, that's a huge win in my mind as far as, you know, getting four cards numbered under, you know, 10, 10, 11, and five. That's... And I, I don't know, do you guys uh, chase chase rainbows? I don't necessarily chase rainbows. I don't try to complete a rainbow unless I get the the one of one. Once I get the one of one, then I might try it a little harder to to complete a rainbow. Uh, go after, you know, higher print numbered cards. A lot of times I just buy cards because I like the way they look. And... Um, 
you know, whenever you start seeing, you know, the, the tri-color out of 175 or, or the whatever color, the 199, they kind of, you kind of, uh, they just kind of get, uh, uh, I don't know, boring, dull, in my opinion. I'll pick them up for, you know, a dollar here, two dollars here if it's an add-on, but I won't pay, pay that one or two dollars even if it's a single card because you're generally going to be looking at, you know, two, three, four dollars shipping on them. But uh, yeah, yeah, I, I'm, uh, I, I feel like Xavier Woods has been uh, playing pretty well for us at safety. Uh, I don't know if he'll be on the team next year or not, so I'm not going to be chasing after too many of his cards, but I always like to add, add, you know, a guy that's playing for my team to my collection and uh, no, no way better to add him to your collection than picking up some short prints, you know. Well, you guys, as I said last time, I'm bad at goodbyes, so I'm just going to say Skullbro Lauren out.